Oh, almost didn't catch the shit. And in Chicago to start out. Ooh, almost did not catch that too. Let's check uh, out this Chicago's is a requested game, so D let's do this. Jimmy Butler, the back Inside at the four and five are Gasol and Noah. Oh my God, I actually made a hook shot with Joe Great looking bounce pass to set up that play. And here's Rondo. Well, with Derrick Rose out of commission last season, the Bulls again look to run their offense through Joe Kim Noah in the high post. Uh, he assisted on almost 25% of their made baskets when he was on the floor. Now here's Parsons. Shot clock at six. I shot oh, I thought he was going to miss that for a second. Very solid offensive execution out there. <coughs> the Mavericks. Yeah, Dunley right there. Becoming the first center to lead his team in assists in over two decades. Tallied 14 assists in one game. I mean, that was the first time in 35 Yeah, Paul Gasol has got the only badges, so I, I don't expect him to miss. Defensively, because that was a blatant mistake. Rose against Rondo. Chandler with a screen for Rondo. Ellis left side. Nowitzki a screen. Ellis kicks to Rondo. Yes, and it's Ellis. Wow. And Joe King Noah, the highest assist average since Claudie Divac over a decade ago. And he became only the fifth center in NBA history to average it. Damn it, I should have gave it to Noah. And five assists per game. That's a pretty impressive part. That's good. Rose has got his first points in this one. He's such a well-rounded offensive player. He's got a little bit of everything. Nowitzki with the screen on Rose. Buries it down low. Nowitzki's got his first two points of the night. Very passing. That was just beautifully done. And the first time out of the game called for Chicago. Well, if you saw the Mavs play here in Dallas last year, you were in for a show. I mean, they were explosive offensively. We will get this. Just about two minutes into the game, first quarter of basketball. And that was good and bad for the Mavs last year, Clark. Great at scoring here, but they also didn't defend very well. Very well or very often, Kevin. Still, it was always a fun time as the Mavs would end up with a 26-15 record here at American Airlines Arena. That's, uh, that's pretty strong home cooking. Doris Burke has some information for us, Doris. Kevin, I had a chance Why you guys let Rondo get right through? Well, he talked about how tough a matchup the Bulls are for any team because of their defense. He said Coach Thibodeau really knows how to prevent an offense from doing what they want. The Bulls are experts in taking away options. If we're going to win, we'll have to find a lot of different ways to get points. Indeed, they will, guys. Ah, right, come on, Dunleavy. Much. Gotta like the defense not quitting on the play and getting a hand in the face. Sure do. With a tough defender breathing down your neck, that makes it not an easy shot. Well, those chances are almost always two points for him. I, I guess the defense did what it had to do to bother. Rose kicks to Buck. Up, he gave me space. From 16, it's good. This time the assist from Rose. Butler's got his second basket. Six changes of the lead here. Yeah, no team able to build a big lead early on. You going, Monte? It's time. You going, Monte? Oh shit! Well, both teams still kind of feeling each other out here, and uh, neither team has been able to to find an edge in this game. Now here's Nowitzki, the 17 footer. That is good. <laughs> Nowitzki's got his second bucket of the night. You know he's got a quick trigger from that range when he senses that the defense has backed off. Well, you talk about the great European players in NBA history. Come on, Nowitzki. Butler, you got it. Yes. At the top of the list. Well, without question. And another distinction, you know, for Dirk is possibly the greatest seven-foot shooter in basketball history. Actually, I think he is. And then with that high release, you know, his jumper is about the closest thing uh, to an unblockable shot as we've seen, you know, since maybe the sky hook back in the day. Catching up on the changes for Dallas. Stoudemire's checked in for good Chandler. stop and Berea subbed in for good defense. Rondo. I mean, Chicago also making some changes. Taj Gibson's uh. for Noah. Miritich comes in for Mike Dunley. Yep. Brooks subbed in for Rose. Now here's Butler. 
Aaron Brooks. Pick it up. Oh, what? How was that out of bounds? Oh, get the fuck out of here. Yeah. You know, you mentioned the sky hook. Dirk has actually been working okay, on whatever. the of that shot with his lifelong German trainer. Um, still tinkering with his game and looking to add to it even now. And he's surely going to be a Hall of Famer. That's part of the reason why he doesn't stop working on improving. And Chicago has possession. Dirk Nowitzki unable to get his shot to go. Gibson inside, and that's out of bounds. Chicago will retain possession. That was an awfully risky pass, guys. Lucky it didn't wind up as a steal. Well, it nearly did wind up as a steal, but no harm done in the end. They hang on to possession. Jefferson's checked in for the Mavericks. Harris comes in for Ellis. Well, Nowitzki has a game that's aging so well with his size and touch. He says in the offseason he trains more just on lower body strength than he does on shooting skills. He's trying to keep that great platform for his shot. Now here's Parsons. No, he's not making that. Rebound Brooks. Had a pretty good look at the basket, but defensively they did a nice job rotating, forcing the miss. Butler on the way. No, nope, wrong person. Dishes to Gibson. Passes to Miritich. He feeds it to Come Brooks. on, Brooks. You fuck. Three off the mark. All right. And we reached the end of the first quarter. We're up by four. It's the Bulls. They're up by four. And the second quarter will be on the way when we come yeah, back. Yeah, yeah, when we come back. Yeah, I know. Can't believe Ronald made that three to up. All right, the second quarter beginning in just a moment. And a moment here to take a look at the scoring breakdown for the Bulls. And they're doing a fantastic job of finding the open man and getting easy looks. Another thing they've been doing so far tonight is knocking down the jump shot. On the court right now, second quarter for the Bulls. Gibson is the four with Gasol. How did that neck knocked out of his head? Heinrich is out there with Brooks, and it's Miritich in at the three. No breathing room at all to take that shot. I see you, Aaron. Damn. Doris. Well, Kevin Powell Gasol made a big move this summer to join the Chicago Bulls. He was courted by a number of teams, but went with his instinct. He sees the Bulls Fuck. as a team that can oh, okay. yeah, I forgot he had bad. Without a doubt, it is one of the championship favorites in the East alongside Cleveland. We'll see how far they go, guys. We will indeed. Thank you, Doris. No! Well, the Bulls were expected to play a role in free agency this past summer with all the cap room they had. A lot of options uh, in terms of which way they could have gone. Brooks, the best to Miritich. Takes it to Gibson. What the fuck was the... What? Unfucking believable. Unfucking believable. Will take possession. I tell you what, that's just a major unforced error right there, guys. My goodness. Yeah, get, sit on the fucking bench for that. It's unbelievable. Two bullshit things have already happened. It's unbelievable. John Rondo is subbed in for JJ Barea. Then for the Bulls, Joakim Noah is checked in for Gasol. Dunleavy comes in for Miritich. And Derek Rose is subbed in for Brooks. Now here is Harris. Oh, so that just so happened to bounce through my fucking legs? Oh, pfft. One, the Get the fuck out of here, Doc. Just two points with the bucket from Rondo. I don't know who was supposed to be on him there, but clearly a mistake by the defense. Here is Rose. He dishes it to Dunley. Rose kicks to Heinrich. Now Dunleavy feeds to Gibson. What, what, what the fuck Six is Taj? From 11 feet away. Oh, okay. I guess That's he can good. do that. Gibson's got his first two points. And now approaching two minutes of action here in the second quarter. Outside Rondo. Chandler with a screen for Harris. And it's Aminu. Why? Who? Okay, we caught a break. Good from outside. Chicago leading by four. Rose dishes to Heinrich. Some nice ball movement by the Bulls. 
Come on, Noah. Yes. And Noah with the nice bucket inside. Noah's got his second basket of the game. The Mavericks have gone two of four shooting the ball here in the second. Joe Kim Noah, last season's defensive player of the year, and for the Bulls, it really seemed like their defense and their offense revolved around Noah. Now here is Harris. He hasn't yet put up any points. Still yet. coming this paint. Here's Aminu. Give me that. That's my Chicago rebound, bitch. Rebound. Noah's got his third rebound tonight. Ah, uh, Dunleavy, only if you were closer. Yes, sir, fellas. They've had it going on big time. Big time. Is oh, here we go. Got it. And that one's good. Good ball movement. You know, as you said, the defensive player of the year and the assist leader for the Bulls last season playing the center position. And that's why he deserved consideration for a spot on MVP balance. The Bulls without Rose, they lost Ding, and yet they still continued to win. I thought Noah's play and his inspiration and, and his desire played a big role in that. Catching up on the changes for Dallas. Nowitzki comes in for Charlie Villanueva. And it's Ellis in for Harris. Ellis kicks to Aminu. Order number two. This was supposed to be on PlayStation, by. but for some strange reason, Back my TV Ellis. decided to be stupid, so I just Six switched the, the Xbox. Clock. He only Monte. Monte. Ticks down. Monte Ellis getting it done. Wow. Outside Rose. Heinrich kicks to Gibson. Back to Heinrich. And here's Rose. Gibson with the screen on Rondo. Rose gets the bucket. Rose has got the lead up to nine now for the Bulls. The second he got around the pick and shook his man, it was straight to the bucket for the easy deuce. Very, very well done. The drive by Rondo. Chandler, the pass to Ellis. Oh, that was, yeah, that's my fault. That was my fault. Ellis has got five points so far. 59 seconds left to play in the first half. Rose kicks to Heinrich. Back to Rose. Over to the left wing. There's the triple. Offensive rebound. Noah dishes to Gibson. And there's the pass to Dunleavy. Give me space. Come on, Rose. The shot will not go. And it's Dallas the other way. And it's Ellis penetrating. Shit, send the jump. Got dirt. We've got 22 seconds left in the first half of basketball. Get that. Amino Good rebound. Assist. Good rebound, Dunleavy. Hold on, hold on, Rose? Pass to Rose. Should have popped it. Noah with a screen for Rose. That's go going us. He knocks it down, but wait a minute. The officials are getting together. They may want to review this one. Ah, uh, another review. Before heading to the locker room, they're going to bring out the monitor and see if he got that shot off in time. Well, now that we can see the replay, it looks like he did get the he shot got off it. in time. It looked that way to me originally, and that's the Yeah, call that was out of his hand. You're right. I think he got it off, but anytime it's as close a call as that was, uh, in a big situation like this, I, I, it's always smart. Clearly, it's out of his hand. Look. And the official call is in. It's ruled a basket. They're overturning. Why does he shake his head like he's saying no? And Kevin, this is exactly why we have this rule. And I think uh, they made a great decision putting the rule in. Uh, the main thing is you want to get it right. And uh, they definitely got this one right looking at the replay. And we've reached halftime in this one. Bulls lead by eight. And now we'll send it down to Doris Burke, who's standing by courtside. Hey, Kevin, with Derrick Rose. Derrick, how does it feel to get back out there on the basketball floor here for the new season ahead? It feels good, man, especially um, playing with my teammates. We have new teammates. We're just trying to come out here and just play hard and compete. Great to have you back, Derrick. Kevin, back to you. Thank you, Doris. And folks, don't go away after the break. We'll see you right back here for the start of the second half in the third quarter.
All right. 13 of 18. Okay, seven assists. Why are you showing the map? All right, here we go. Joe Kino, four rebounds. Derek Rose, two assists. Okay, so who has more points? It don't even fucking matter. All right. the second half about to start up and begin any moment you look at jimmy butler he's really been playing well but he created a lot of opportunities for himself in the first couple of quarters and all right let's, let's, let's smart with we can look at cheerleaders later he really took good ones you know points per shot attempted is really one of the undervalued stats in the game and it's a real measurement of efficient scoring move nigga damn you know okay the mavericks is they're not going to sit back and stand pat they want to reload, not rebuild every year. The forwards are Parsons and Dirk. Uh, oh, we got a break. Chandler in at center. So that's who Rick Carlisle starts the second half with. Now Butler. Rondo missing on the three. Some nice ball movement by the ball. Oh, he's got Monte on him. This should be an easy basket. Come on, Noah! No! And extend the lead to double digits. Guys, the Mavericks have made the most out of this run. Nope, get out the paint, get out the paint, get out the paint. We don't want to call. team for so long because they never tore it down. And there were times they could have. I mean, you have to respect that mentality that, you know, they've maintained their unity, their continuity. And it, as long as you have Dirk. No, you don't. Get that out of there. him to be competitive. That's what the Mavs have always done. Ellis can't get it to go. It's been a cold spell for them coming out of the half, missing their first three shots. A tough okay. Start. Nice wide open shot. I'll take it. By Dunleavy. And that's now nine points for Did they really just call another time? Oh, come on. The mismatch that he had and uh, immediately cashing in with that mid range jumper. Dallas calls timeout. Get to the basket. Play physical defense. And so here is Dallas trailing by 10. Clark, some tough offensive sets. They want to turn it around. Yeah, they need a basket just to regain some momentum here, Kevin. No, you're not giving it. Ah, oh, Rose. No, get that out of here, bitch. And that's out of bounds. Dallas will retain possession. Sorry for my languages, ref. Don't give me a technical foul for that. Right around a minute and a half played here in the third quarter. And the shot is good from Nowitzki. That was an important bucket. They're only one of five now, so they really had to get their offense clicking. Well, we've all seen what Tyson Chandler can accomplish when healthy, and that is some kind of force. Yeah, you know, maybe the best stretch of his career was at the start of the decade, a 2011 title with the Mavericks. 2012, he got a goal. Butler, medal. wide open. And got it again. In the league, and in 2013, five, for five shooting 100% from the field. And so it's Dallas with it. Following the three-point basket by Chicago. Here's Nowitzki. Good, and the assist goes to Ellis. And it's eight points for Dirk Nowitzki. Now the defense just couldn't get a hand in his face. Couldn't challenge the shot. Yeah, made his height advantage count that time. Not quite two and a half minutes played here in the second half. Rose dishes to Noah. The kick out to Rose. Six to shoot. The feed to Butler. Wants to get it off to Noah and does. Good foul. And so he draws the foul on the shot on trip to the line to shoot two. Monte Ellis a scoring combo guard. The, the highest career scoring average ever, Steve, for a player never to be selected. I thought as an everybody was going to get a big he's ahead in the game, been on but that I guess it's just Some of stuff. it, Kevin, has to do with, you know, he's only been on a winning team three of his eight seasons. Yeah. Two of those in Golden State, and then, of course, last year in Dallas. Yeah. But. You also think about the depth in the backcourt in the Western Conference. Boy, it's tough to, to make that all-star team. Here is Berea. Quiet so far. No. Uh. First points of the game. And that assist earned him a little nod from his teammate after the basket. The Bulls leading by nine. And you know, for Ellis, at times he's been criticized as a volume scorer and not a great defender. Sometimes these labels that players get are hard to shake, whether they're true or not. But I think you can see improvement 
in Ellis's game in both areas. And if he can help the Mavs win big, I think he could be an all-star. Should be an all-star. Here is Brooks after Amari Stoudemire's bucket. Damn, that was just a good kick outside to Butler. Trying to get Miritich a play here, but not Jefferson picks going. him up. Miritich sets the screen for Brooks. Pass to Miritich. Back to Brooks. Six on the shot clock. The Bulls need to get a shot off here. Here's Noah. Damn it. Misses off the left eye. Had that been an excellent release, that definitely would. Ellis defensively, quick hands, great in passing lanes. And of late, he's done better one-on-one. Uh, -on -one. I think playing for a... Why would you? Coach like Rick Carlisle has helped him at that end of the court. And Doris Burke has a report for us from the sideline. Yes, Kevin, the Bulls, known for their hard-nosed style of play, something Coach Tom Thibodeau calls, quote, Chicago tough. Center Joe Kim Noah said, I don't think our style would work everywhere. It represents our city. Our whole thing is playing with more of an edge than the other team. He added, we aren't scared of anybody. Guys? Hey, don't back down. Thanks, Doris. How about the passing? They are moving the ball without any thought, without any agenda. It's hard to overstate all the points they've scored on assists today. Beautiful to watch. Now, here is Miritich. He's been patient so far. Oh, that was nice. And he gets it to go. They haven't been as aggressive from outside as they were in the first half. They're playing smart with the lead. I like that. They're being very selective and deliberate. No, bitch. And that's a good strategy when you're on top. They've been the glass eaters today, guys. A ton of effort out of them down low. And they've needed every one of those rebounds. I think that's what's put them in front here. Here is Brooks. And Miritich kicks the butt. That's a bad pass. It's stolen by Jefferson. Perea with it. Harris outside. Passes it to Nowitzki. Back to Harris. Outside Jefferson. Here's Berea. Hands it from downtown. What a terrific job to get the release perfect that time. I thought it might get blocked or deflected, but nice stroke. Even with giving up a lot of size in that matchup, still able to get off a nice long-range shot there. Damn it! The third quarter comes to a close. Bulls out front, up five. And fourth quarter basketball will be coming your way on 2K Sports right after this. All right, I got to practice it. And a chance right now to show you our State Farm assist of the game. Well, today it comes from one of the men in the middle. Kevin, let me tell you, anytime you get a big man who can pass like this, it really changes the way you can play offense, diversifies your offensive attack. Let me ask you, who is the best passing big man you played with? Luke Longley. Ah, the Australian. Yeah. Yes. Big redhead. Good passer down on the low block. The number one pick by the Minnesota Timberwolves. All right, let's do this. Chicago leading by five. Taking a look at the Bulls. D. Rose and Jimmy Butler, the back. Dunleavy is out there with Miritich. And it's Gibson in at the pivot spot, manning the middle. High. Ah! Out to the wing. Don Levy, the pass to Rose. All right, looks like Derek wants it. Second shot opportunity, and that's two points on the layup. Rose oh. has got the Derek wanted it, gave it to him, and he scored. Dallas has gone four of eight tonight from three-point land, shooting 50% on the three ball here. And the defense. Outside Rondo, Ellis outside. He tries for three. Get up there! So he gets the whistle, contact on the way up, and two shots coming up. Great job, take it right at the defense. Of course like he's gonna make him. Yeah, he left him no choice but to foul there. Joakim Noah, he's checked in for Taj Gibson. No. Chandler okay. hits them both. Totally. The Bulls leading by five. Fourth quarter of basketball. We're about a minute into it. Unleavy kicks to Rose. He was wide open. Rose with another miss. Mavericks shooting has been great up over 50%. In fact, 52%. 
now here's Rondo. Oh shit, I fell asleep. Damn it. Good. Well, he wasn't phased at all by the bigger man on him. And on the low block, I thought he might be. You know, Steve, I thought maybe he'd prefer to bring him out to the perimeter. Uh, I wish Gasol was in the game. Go to it. Now here's Rose. Down to five on the shot clock. He kicks it to Dunley. Oh, get the fuck out of here. Here's Ellis. No! He went like right past me. Picks up the assist. That's seven points for Ellis. Rondo, a master at setting up teammates. Rose against Rondo. Rose in the post. Ellis against Butler. Pocket six. Rose attacking, and he goes Damn. for the dunk. How about that? Take a peek at that move. We don't get to see plays like that. Very I no, was not expecting right. him to do that, actually. For the reverse dunk. Yeah, boy, what a dunk. That is just special. Dallas calls timeout. Yeah, he definitely saw some things that were not working for them out there. And now he's going to make some adjustments. I'm not sure what it was, but he clearly wanted something to change out there. Is Powell Doris not coming Doris back in? Doris. Yes, thanks, guys. I got a chance to hear what Rick Carlisle was saying to the team. The three-pointers obviously have been hurting them, and he told his players, we've simply got to play them tighter on the perimeter. We can't afford to give them these wide-open looks. Kevin? And the hot shooting continues, guys. Yeah, it sure does, Steve. Um, they've mothballed the defense, though. It's all about offense today. Now here's Rose. The kick outside to Butler. Good ball movement here by the Bulls. Oh, God, I'm leaning. No, what are you doing? Levitsky. To take the lead, and Ellis finishes inside. Ellis has got the lead up to one now for the man. And they're beginning to fall apart a little bit defensively, especially inside. Well, that's four straight buckets now at the rim. Noah. Oh, man, I thought that was going to get blocked. Rose. Rose has got his fourth assist with that last one here tonight. The Mavericks have gone an outstanding four or five from the field in the fourth quarter so far. Novitski dishes to Rondo. Just tuning in. Welcome. We've got about three and a half minutes gone here in the fourth quarter. Nah! Cooking. Ten points for Dirk Nowitzki. Time running low, guys, and uh, somebody has got to win this one. You know, quite honestly, Kevin and Steve, I mean, this game is close as it's been. You really hate to see it come to an end. Why are we playing through Jimmy Butler? Let's root for overtime. <laughs> Why not? How Gasol's checked in for Chicago. No, 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 no. We played just over three and a half minutes now in the fourth quarter. Oh, Gasol, are you for real? He's got six rebounds in the game. Rondo drives in. No good. Some no, it's kind of like Rondo, are you for Chicago real? Trailing here. To the left side wing. Unleavy kicks to Buck. Yes. Somebody That's what I wanted you to do. And the Mavericks call time here. They trailed by one. 52 seconds. That's why I wanted Gasol quarter. back in the game. Here is Rondo. Nowitzki with the screen on Rose. Rondo passes to Nowitzki. Good. He's been one of their more reliable options today, guys. I mean, his shooting has led them to this lead. And Chicago shooting it well here in the fourth quarter, 50%. Now here's Rose. Dishes it to Butler. Eight away. Money! Ooh, a pressure basket right there. Now that's coming through in the clutch. Steve, what a big possession right here. No doubt, guys. You can feel the tension in this building. Seven second difference, shot and game clock. Here's Novitsky. Oh, 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 shit. Defense better not make a habit of giving him that shot. I mean, he doesn't miss many of them. Yeah, you can't let them pound the ball and just milk those precious seconds away. 
no other option here but to foul and hope for a few misses. I right, get in there. They oh, okay. Foul to give here. Yeah, you might see them use that at some point. I would. Dallas calls timeout. They're down by three. 15 seconds left in the fourth quarter of this one. What's your take, guys? Well, they've got two options here. They can go for the three and the tie, or the quick two and the foul. No, what are you doing? Oh, we got this. And, um, that was oh, get it. Oh, oh, watch out now. Oh. No I didn't know what had happened there for a second. That went through any way he wanted. And I love the choice there, partner. Going hard to the hoop. Well, that throw down. Yeah, 